Oh, breaking news into our newsroom. It's still hot out there. Uh, you probably could have guessed it this morning, but your AC pumping all night because, I mean, it yeah. barely got cooler. I mean, we didn't really cool off overnight. We didn't. We have temperatures that are running above normal in the morning hours. We even tied a record warm morning yesterday. Wow. We only got down to 82 degrees, and it's still warm and muggy out there. That heat advisory, Steve, it's sticking with us, unfortunately. Mm -hmm. Yeah, when you talk about these numbers going up and up and up, mm -hmm. People just need to be careful because, yeah. look, we're accustomed to the heat, but this advisory in and of itself reminds us, I don't care if you're working, I don't care if you are dropping off the kids, this is serious stuff. It yeah. is, and that's why we do have the advisories from the National Weather Service to bring attention to the fact that this is so hot out there. So we are going to see those feels like temperatures getting up to near 110 degrees, and look at the wow. temperatures over the next uh, several days. We are looking at triple-digit air temperatures. That's not even taking into account the humidity, which is what makes it feel so hot outside, what adds that extra stress on our body. And with high humidity, we are going to continue to see those heat index values up around 110 right through the week. Again. So we've had this heat advisory through Monday. It does take a little while for our bodies to start to somewhat acclimate to this heat. I mean, it's still dangerous. Even once we start to get used to it, you still need to remember those heat safety precautions. But we are starting off with some cloud cover on first alert future cast, and we have a stalled out frontal boundary in the area. So we are looking at the potential with some daytime heating, all that moisture out there. We could get an isolated shower or storm developing around the Metroplex. But once that sun goes down, we're losing that heating and any of those showers are going to come to an end. But the pool is a great place to be. We'll have a mix of sun and clouds today. 92 degrees by noon will already be feeling like the triple digits. That high today around 99, but we'll be feeling up to 110 degrees. And it's this heat dome. I mean, we're just one month into summer if you go by meteorological summer. And we are still going to be talking about this heat dome into July and August, Madison. That's when we really start to see that heat cranking up even more. Yeah, and it's hard to imagine it getting hotter than it is right now, but we know that it can go up from here. Thanks, Brittany.